Hey folks, Captain Mark here from King's Landing Sport Fishing. It is Sunday, May 28th. I think it's probably about 1 p.m. now, and I want to give you guys a quick fishing report. Before I do that, just a reminder for those of you that just started following the channel, uh, please make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit the like button. Helps me out a great deal as an amateur YouTube content producer. So this will be a quick report today. Um, but, you know, I gotta tell you, how's the fishing? The fishing is as good as it gets right now, in my opinion. Fantastic morning. I had uh, had four guys with me, uh, John, John, Marco, and Steve. And we were out to see what we could do, do some damage out there. So I ran a big spread this morning, put out the big John uh, auto boats, um, you know, lots of long lines, lots of riggers and divers, had a 10 rod spread and uh, we smashed them really, really good. I think we had 22 plus bites. We honestly lost count. Um, I'm gonna tell you a couple of quick things. First of all, they seem to want meat. Almost all those bites came on meat. The, we did have a flash or fly down. I think it took two or three bites. Um, the flash or fly was the Project Salmon slushy uh, in the chartreuse dots with a fly similar to the Yoda fly that I have on the Project Salmon site. That was uh, what was taking the fish uh, on the 200 weighted steel. The, the 300 weighted steel and the 350, they both had uh, split personality uh, flashers with meat. They both took fish. Divers were a little slower for us today. Um, the one diver that did have, I think, two or three wax was the 250 Mag Diver. Um, it had uh, split personality green dots with matching head and some uh, glowing UV Twinkies. It took, I think, two or three shots. And, uh, you know, a lot of the damage came on the riggers. Uh, had three riggers out. Center rigger was the spoon rigger. It had one shot. That was it. Uh, they don't seem to want spoons. Uh, lots of fish swimming around that rigger. They just didn't want to take the spoon. But um, the other two riggers, they were meat. 11-inch uh, uh, glow super frog with the animal bait head on the 110. Later on, it became the 100 rigger. Uh, it took a whole whack load of fish. And the 155 rigger with the Project Salmon split personality can't decide hot fish 10 with uh, green animal bait head. It took I can't remember how many fish and good fish weighed a 22 pounder a 21 pounder a couple in the 18 19 range a couple of uh, you know mid teenagers good good fish and then the last rod I had out I did have a five color out it took I think one or two rainbows and we lost I think one fish so tremendously good fishing out here right now it is as good as it gets in my opinion um, it's, you know, I keep pinching myself. It's only May 28th and we got fantastic fishing here out of the bluffs. Uh, it was a bit busier today. There was probably 20, 25 boats, but you know, everyone stuck to their, uh, stuck to their line. No, uh, no messes, no tangles. And I think, uh, some decent fishing. I saw a bunch of other people with, uh, with, uh, rods bouncing. Uh, I think the nice thing is though, instead of being an only deep bite, I took fish from 40 feet to 150 feet down. The one thing I missed, I'll tell you guys, I stuck, I stuck with trolling the 200 line. So 200 to 220 was where I trolled. Um, I set up just on the east side of the water filtration plant and trolled all the way to the eastern gap of the islands, spun around. I think we hit one or two fish on the turn and then trolled all the way back, picking away at fish the whole way. As good as it gets, that's all I can say. So anyways, I hope that you find this valuable. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe. Hope you guys can get out. I won't be out again until probably um, next weekend. I got a couple of uh, evening trips, uh, I think on Saturday and Sunday, but uh, no no morning trips. Gonna probably take the mornings and relax. But anyways, uh, have fun guys. Uh, get out there and fish. It is as good as it gets on the, on the, um, on the North Shore, in my opinion. And, you know, congratulations to uh, Team Real Therapy for winning the uh, St. Catharines Fishing Game Spring Derby. Um, you know, we all think about that derby as being a South Shore derby, but guess what, folks? They got that fish fishing the Toronto Islands because the fish are, they're here and they're biting. So anyways, get out and do some fishing, folks. Have a good one. See you later.